What's up, Cancer? Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, what's up? Come on in here, hop on the couch, kick your feet up, relax and enjoy yourselves, boo. Grab your weed, blunt, cigarettes, drink, fruit, water. Hell, I don't give a fuck, just do you. But allow me to say thank you to all my beautiful subscribers for all the love and support that you show me. Because you don't have to, booze, and you do it for that. It truly means the world to me. Thank you so much. All right, my lovely Cancers, we're back with another general love reading. You know, getting some general current love messages on what's currently going on in your love life. All right, so it's just some random messages. Whatever come out, we're going to take it. We got protected, hit the lottery, new job. Okay, some of you um, got um, got new jobs, got promoted, you know, um, got tired of your old job and uh, decided, you know, it was time for a change. Maybe you needed, um, you had a new baby or something or, you know, just a new addition to the family and, you know, you needed a new job. So, um, you took on a new job. Some of you took on a new job. Some of you stopped. Uh, working at your previous job and started a new job. So, congratulations. All right, for some of you, you will be hitting the lottery. Okay, you be going in there and getting that right ticket, hitting the right numbers, baby. All right, you be hitting the lottery. All right, moving out. Okay, forget a job. You won't be, uh, there won't be no job in your life. Okay, after you, well, some of you probably work shit after you hit the lottery, but other shit. Y'all going about y'all business. Y'all be living y'all life like it's golden. All right, so spirit's telling you, all right, if you feeling unsafe, all right, you know, feeling like somebody's trying to do some type of harm, you send some type of evil eye, you're always protected, all right, no matter what. We got in your favor. Indecisive on whether I want to stay or go. So sexual intercourse. So maybe some of you are indecisive on taking this new job, okay? Or maybe some of you are indecisive on, um, you know, playing that lotto ticket, okay? But uh, Spirit's saying, yeah, you take the new job, okay? It'll be, um, it's going to be a ben in a bit in benefit for you, okay, in the long run. And especially when you hit them down, not, uh, especially hitting this, uh, 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 especially hitting them numbers, especially, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah. Uh, don't be indecisive, indecisive, go hit them numbers, but yeah, maybe some of you are indecisive on, um, whether you want to stay and go where you live, okay, whether you want to stay and go in a relationship, okay, whether you want to stay and go in a family, you know, um, being roommates with a family member or whatever, but, um, yeah, you being indec indecisive on whether you want to stay and go, okay, because probably shit you, you know, um, you guys shared a lot of memories and, you know, it's, bittersweet so shit it's kind of you know you damned if you do damned if you don't you're gonna be heartbroken either way shit but um yeah spirit said um yeah def um definitely um don't be indecisive on hitting them numbers because it will be in your favor okay and if you want to uh if you it being indecisive for whether you don't want to take this job or not take the job because it's going to be in your favor okay all right Maybe some of you want to have uh, sexual intercourse. You haven't had sexual intercourse in probably a year or two, okay? And, you know, maybe it's somebody that, you know, that you got your eye on and you've been liking for a minute and that you want to shoot your shot to, but you th probably thinking things ain't going to work out. But, you know, uh, yeah. It, uh, Spirit saying it's going to be in your favor. Go ahead and do that. So we got catfished, seeing the truth, and 
unlocking your gifts. So some of you are unlocking your gifts, okay? Being high, being more highly, highly psychic, okay? Very intuitive, okay? Could be one of the Claire's, Claire audience, Claire Cynthia's. Um, but yeah, you're seeing the truth in something, okay? Okay, maybe it, when it came to somebody having sexual intercourse with somebody else, and this is why you're being indecisive on what indecisive on whether you want to stay or go. Okay, because you put a lot of um, um, you invested a lot of time with this person. You probably got kids with this person for some of you, okay? But um, if you decide you want to go, okay, spirit saying shit, whatever you want to do, it which whatever whichever you decide is gonna both be in your favor. Okay, but some of you was dealing with somebody and you got catfished. Okay, that you finally seeing the truth that tr seeing the truth about. Okay, you finally seeing that you got catfished by this person. Okay. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's some yeah. Maybe it's something. Maybe it's for some of you, somebody you thought you was going to have sex with. I don't know. You know, just for some of you. But let's get some more messages. We got upset. Someone you can you can trust. And black vehicle. So maybe somebody you guys are dealing with that you can somebody that you can trust is upset. I don't know. Maybe you guys got in a little spat and shit. You know what I'm saying? So nothing serious. You know, because you know you can trust this person. You know, but uh, yeah, maybe they're a little upset, or you can, or you could be a little upset. You know what I'm saying? Even though you could still trust, even though you can trust them, you know what I'm saying? But whatever happened between you guys, you know what I'm saying, made you upset. Okay. Maybe we got we got sacrifice. Been healing by doing shadow work. They want your peace. Maybe you upset because you thought you can, um, it was somebody that you was dealing with that you thought you could trust, but you couldn't trust them. And you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you found that out. But yeah, um, it was some people, yeah, some of you, this person wanted, uh, you dealing with, you could deal with, you're dealing with people that's under you that want your significant other. They want to sleep with, yeah, your boo. They want your boo, okay? Maybe your boo got it going on. Maybe you went ran your mouth and told them how good your boo do it and shit. And how good your boo take care of you, okay? And, yeah, now they got all curious and shit, okay? And you thought this was somebody you can trust. And now you highly upset because they tried to, you know... Make advances at your boo and your boo told you and shit, okay? And this is somebody that you uh, made a, a lot of sacrifices for, okay? You took the shirt off your back for this person. There was nothing you could, wouldn't do for this person, okay? <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, you left that person alone and you've been healing do and, taking, and doing some shadow work yourself, working on your shadow side, you know what I'm saying, to better yourself. To higher your uh, frequency and your vibration. Kudos to you. For some of you, you can also be healing yourself. Because somebody has tried, literally tried to sacrifice you. Just apply it to your life. I may fit and lead the rest. And you thought it was somebody you can trust. And you upset.
We got chosen. Confused. Fuck him. Yeah, so maybe like I said, you confused and upset because you this you thought some you thought this was somebody you can trust. Okay. And especially especially this person that wanted to sleep with your uh, 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 significant other that was making advances and shit and doing shit. Okay, and the person that you sacrificed probably it could have been a best friend. You know what I'm saying? Somebody that you trust. Okay, and get your shirt off. Take your uh, <clears throat> trust with your life. At least you thought. <clears throat> Okay, and others, you know, this is somebody, you know, you could have been dealing with in a relationship, okay, and you feeling confused about it because you was in a relationship with this motherfucker, so you thought, of course you thought you can trust this motherfucker, you was in a relationship with them, and yeah, they tried to sacrifice you, okay, doing type, doing spells, you know, being into witchcraft and shit, <clears throat> but yeah, spirit said you are the chosen. You, you know what I'm saying? Can't nobody sacrifice you. You're protected. You're cho you're the chosen one. Okay? And fuck them. Okay? You can't be touched. And people out here want your peace because you chose it. Okay? Yeah. They want what you got because you're the chosen one. Let's get another message. Oh, that was the second message. That was the second message. All right, we got fire sign. If fire sign may be involved. Pinky promise, a promise has been made. Water sign, a water sign may be involved. Reviewing the reviewing the past. You may be reviewing the, re reviewing the past at this time. A past situation may be coming back to the surface for you to deal with at this time. Let me get you an advice card and I'll leave it here. Druid, hold the space. Let me read it for you and I'll leave it here. Hold the hold things together. Don't make any sudden moves or changes. Stay strong, knowing that where you are, you are where you're supposed to be. When the Druid card appears in a reading, you're being guided to dig deep within the with within and hold your station. If you're wondering what to do next or have a sense of anxiety about what is unfolding in your life, it's time to shift your perception perceptions and move back to the state of trust. Don't change your plans or do anything drastic. Trust in the process and let everything happen in, as it needs to be before taking any more steps. Think of a tree as it has strong roots, yet continues to grow and bear fruit. Your life will be a reflection of this. All right, me love, so I'm going to leave it here. If this resonated with you guys, go ahead and give your girl a big thumbs up. If not, go ahead and give your girl a big thumbs down. I really don't give a fuck long as you take heed to the message. All right, me love, so thanks for watching. And until next time, same bad time, same bad child. All right, deuces.